Yeah. Okay. Just so guys, watch this. When you throw in someone, it's just not like you have to use your muscles and just push them down and throw it. See, when I, if I want to use my muscle to against Ala or anybody, I can throw anything. But I, I'm, when I fight you, any one of you, I try not to use my body weight and I'm not trying to use my muscle. All right? I'm trying to use my technique. So when I, you fight me, you don't feel I'm a, most of heavier than you are or anything. I say I'm a 200 pounds. So if I have to use my muscles and my body weight, then I, if somebody lighter than me, I can throw him many times. But I'm trying to go technical because muscle is not a correct fighting way to do it. So you have to use the body movements, okay? When you get older like me, you get slowed down a little bit. But when you're young, you don't don't supposed to slow down. So now, what you have to do, you have to move the leg. Now, I want to do the technique. See, watch this. I wanted to punch it inside the inside the throw and outside the throw. So now, what what I have to do? Do inside one. See, watch this. When I'm fighting here, I'm look like showing him I'm doing a hip throw here. See, like here, I'm doing a hip throw, slow motion. I'm moving this here, this direction. Now, I got this situation here. It's very simple for me to kick this and knock him down because the situation changed. Watch what happened. When I kick this leg, so he doesn't want to give this leg, so he's pushed back. Now he leaves this leg alone. It's not, you will never see anybody do this, all right? If you do that, then something else will come up, all right? So, very simple here. When you fight in here, very light. You know, when you fight in, you can have a good grip, but not the grip like he, don't let him uh, break it. Let him break it, it's okay. If you have a grip like you don't let him to break it, then you can hurt your fingers in the training. And then when you go tournament, then your fingers are already very bad. Then uh, you're not going to be able to give a good performance. So just go light. If you break it, it's okay. Okay. So now, grip at this. So now, I'm moving in. Here. Now, you see, this is the situation, but I'm not pausing like this. I'm going to go right away. Boom. So now I'm going to do fast. Watch what happens here. When I fight here, I go here. So that's basically the first one. Second one here. Now you're going to do rotation. Now this, this one I'm attacking here. You see here? I'm attacking here. But the other one, I'm, attack, I'm, I'm here, my leg is going here. You see, my leg here and his leg there, all I have to do just do my throw. But I'm preparing him, okay? So preparation is, from here, you cannot just do like this and then prepare. You have to move as, as inch as inch is very important. Watch this, here, here, I leave the leg here for this reason, okay? If you move the leg with it, then he can sweep you and knock you down. If you go complete. So what you do, here. Here, leave it here, then you go in. So not, that's the second, secondary things you're gonna try, okay? And also, I was showing a Romic there. Also, a lot of people hold you, the grip, you here. You grab the two, two hands in one, here, like this. So here, you grab in your body, you bring this too close to you. So because if you pull with your hand, you're using your hand muscle. But if you're here, your body is more stronger than your hand. So, and also it's, it's very good defense for you if in case he wants to throw you. If you do it here, basically you open, he can enter. Here, you see, Longest, I, I like to see this leg forward. See here, one and two. This is very, this is in my, in, more than enough for me. So now, if I want to throw him, I'm not pulling, I'm not pushing. I'm pulling this side. So here, then here I go take it. Okay, so watch this here. One, two, three, as soon as you walk, don't let it go until you rotate because you need to go to an armbar or a sekomi, whatever you want to do after it. 